I'm at Dodger Stadium today, and uh, they're going to be playing the Arizona Diamondbacks. This is my first time um, coming here this season. It's my first time since I was here at NLDS Game 5, where they lost badly against the Nationals. I was actually uh, filming that one, and this is the one that had the most views on my channel, the um, NLC at NLDS Game 5 in 2019, and I haven't been back since until today. I'm going to go check out the renovations. They uh, did a lot of renovations here at Dodger Stadium, so I'm going to go to line up and wait to get inside. We should be getting inside in about a few minutes. They put a gate in center field, which is pretty neat. I'm going to go through it. The thing that sucks about this stadium is that it opens one hour before first pitch, so you miss batting practice. As you see, they're putting away the batting cage net behind me. I'm only going to come here one time this year until they open the stadium up um, earlier than one hour before first pitch. But I just want to check out the renovations today. That's the main goal is to check out the renovations of the stadium. Some of the stadiums that uh, I think Baltimore opens one hour before first pitch. But they leave a lot of balls. These people don't. <laughs> That's what I don't like about this place. They don't leave any balls for the fans. It's kind of ridiculous. These guys need to come down South to Angel Stadium. They open up um, an hour and a half before first pitch. At least you get 30 minutes of batting practice down south. Yeah, definitely come down um, to Angel Stadium. They open up earlier. While we wait for the game, I'm going to go around the stadium and just uh, film some areas that look like they renovated. This is definitely new. They have a scoreboard out here. Pavilions. Go up to the pavilion. They'll probably go there first. Yeah. It's definitely going to spend a lot of time going around here and uh, exploring the place. It's like actually two areas you can enter. I'm wondering if this is standing room only area. Probably stand here and just wait for home runs to come. It's pretty neat. Yeah, so I'm in the walkway, this huge walkway, so you can walk into the pavilion. You can actually see the view of the field from here. Yeah, they have a um, walkway up there too. I decided to do a voiceover here. They have the home run seats below. They use a walkway down there where you could uh, stand below and um, wait for balls to come over, but you can't do that anymore. This is a really exclusive area. You need like VIP access to go down there. They actually use zip ties to socially distance the fans, and it looked like that was a play area, but I guess not. On top of the pavilion, you have seats where you can sit at. I'm not sure if those are, t those are probably ticketed seats. You can probably wait there. Um, balls do come up here sometimes, probably during batting practice. But a uh, few have actually made it over the pavilion, including Mark McGuire's and maybe Mike Piazza, just to name a few. But not very many have actually gone over, just a few of them. We are now in right field. This used to be an all-you-can-eat pavilion, but it looks like they took that away. I'm gonna miss that, all the all-you-can-eat food. Down below, they have a lot, a lot of places you can order food, like taqueria, street tacos, a Shake Shack, Jim Bean, Bio Bowls, must be some rice bowls or something like that. Place to eat down there. A lot of um, sand. Now, seating started getting more busier. Down below, a um, bunch of famous Dodgers here. Tommy Lasorda, he rest in peace. There's some batting cages down here for the kids to play at. There's some World Series stuff right here. Here's game six, this must be the lineup card. Series in Texas. Going to game four of that. Um, 
hip. Some gold gloves. Oh, boy, I hate that. I know. Seventies, fifty-nine. Regmatics. There's a Dodger pitcher in the bullpen. Okay, this area off sucks. He'll sit here, watch them pitch, but I think they want to give them some distance. Warm it up in there. vaccinated sections you get to save money but I would prefer to sit where there's less people <laughs> Thank you. 
Yoshi Sugo, Japanese name. Second deck. I mean, I nice. <laughs> this can come up here.
Okay, so I'm back at home. I decided to do the outro at home because I need to leave the stadium, beat all the traffic. Otherwise, if I did the outro there, I'd be sitting in traffic for like an hour. You know, L.A., uh, the Dodger Stadium is kind of a pain in the rear end to get out of, especially if you're like waiting in to wait to get out and it seemed like you could wait a while to get out of the parking lot. So I definitely decided to make a good decision. I got out real quick. I got home in like less than an hour. The Dodgers ended up winning 9-1. to I had a good time at the stadium. I enjoyed seeing the stadium for the first time um, since it was renovated. It's been a while since I was there. I am not going to go to that stadium until they reinstate batting practice. I did see that they suspended batting practice until further noted. I'll definitely be going to Angel Stadium and even San Diego because they let their uh, fans in earlier, like two hours, hour and a half before game time. So anyways, uh, I want you to thank you for watching my video. Please subscribe if you haven't already. And thank you for being a subscriber if you've been subscribed to my channel. Have a great day.